guys and welcome to my channel. So today it is Battle of the Boxes and I haven't been here for a couple of weeks since I did my unboxings for Glossy Box, Birch Box and Pink Parcel. But I thought this video needs to be done and um, yeah, it's a sunny day. I wanted to do my makeup so I'm feeling energised to do it. So um, yeah, I thought I'd pop on with this video which is Battle of the Boxes for the month of May. Let's get cracking into the video. So we have May's Boxes. And they are Pink Parcel for this month and Birch Box and Glossy Box. Right, so I'm going to start with Pink Parcel because I just wrote it down first. So Pink Parcel is a funny one because I don't really know how much Pink Parcel is going to be from now on. It was £12.99. I paid £10.50. Now I don't know what it's going to be because we got an email and it said something like it's going up by £11. But then there's going to be postage but you have to pick postage online. So it was a bit vague and I thought, well, does that mean that I have to go on and pick postage? If I don't, I'll just get it whenever and I still pay £11. I don't know how it works. So I'm really waiting for the first because I think that's the new payment schedule. They'll come out on the first of the month. So I'm really waiting for that to see what I'm actually going to pay. Um, so yeah, I don't know what I'm going to pay. And if it is £13.50, which I think it might be, I don't know if I'll be sticking around with Pink Parcel. The reason why I stuck around with them it was they kept me as a legacy um subscriber for £10.50 and for me to leave I would then have to go and pay £12.99 so it just kept me with Pink Parcel forever because they had kept me at that deal I thought that was an amazing customer service and then also if you cancelled you wouldn't get back to that you'd have to pay £12.99 so they were my reasons for sticking around with Pink Parcel and really not being hard on them very often because I am very hard on them but I'm not hard on any boxes because generally I find something I like um, so yeah, I have been a little bit more nicer to Pink Parcel when things have maybe not been going as great. But now the price increase with £13.50, I don't know if I'm going to be paying that. I'm not sure. Some boxes are amazing for £12.99 or £13.50, but then other boxes have not been. £10.50, yes, it's alright. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to give it another shot this month, see what June's box is like, because you never know, that might just sway me. But I don't know. Anyway, first one we had was the scrubber. And as you can see, I've not opened it. It's still in its package. So yeah, I've not opened it. But I do like facial scrubbers. I do like the body scrub. I've got that in the bath. And I have used it before. So they are good products. Then we had a little bit of chocolate. I ate it. <laughs> it's gone. And we had the tea bag. I haven't opened the tea bag. I don't use the tea bags. So that just goes in a tea, be tea bag box. Then we had the scrub. And this scrub here. Now, this has been in the bath and I use it. It's a facial scrub and I've been using it in the bath to take off my makeup. And it's absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it smells divine. When I went online, well, no, I didn't. I think a subscriber told me on my video that it was worth like about 30 quid or 20 quid. I might be totally over exaggerating, which is normal for me. But um, yeah, it was really expensive. And I thought, I don't know if I'd buy it for that price. But in the box, it was amazing. It makes your skin feel lusciously smooth after you've used it. And I love it. And the smell is just divine. And then the next one was the overnight hair mask, which I haven't used yet. And this is it. It's living proof. I do love living proof, but I just haven't used it. It's not been the best month for taking care of my hair or anything about myself. So, um, yeah, I need to use it. I should. And then we had a face mask, which I can't find. I don't know where I've put it. Somewhere over there, maybe in my face mask, face mask box. <laughs> Try and say that when you've had a few drinks. Oh uh, yeah, it's over there somewhere. And it was just like a little shell and um, beta masks and stuff, but I'm just notoriously bad for using face masks. I need to start a face mask Friday so that I can just use them. And then we had a food, supp a food supplement and that was by Matcha or Matcha, Matasha. I can't remember, but I didn't use that either, so that's not there. So anyway, that is it for Pink Parcel. I thought Pink Parcel was good this month. I really enjoyed the products, especially this one. I think this is lush, and I want to use this. I love Living Proof, and I love a facial scrubber. So it's just that I have others there before I use these. So yeah, that was Pink Parcel. Right, now we're going on to Birch Box, which is... £12.95 per month and you get five beauty products in there. A lovely little box. Birch Box does a different box every month and that's what I love. I love their boxes and the designs. They're stunning. They're on the little side, but that matches Birch Box because they are generally little sizes. So yeah, did I mention £12.95? I think I did. Tenner for the box, £2.95 for your postage and packing. And that stays pretty much like that. Always stays at that price. And we got a heel balm, which was a strange 
thing to get and a full size item like you never get full size items of other things but you get it for that so yeah I've been using it and it's all right it wasn't a visible result after one day which it says on here visible results after one day it's not the case but it is quite nice um, and it soaks in really really fast Lady Mawa who is another beauty box unboxer pop on over to our channel she's amazing um, she is a nurse and she recommends this product for her patients and has done in the past so yeah good product and then we had the elasticizer now I watched Lady Mawa's video as well and this says on Birchbox that this is a full size item it ain't and Lady Mawa is going to know about that because she loves this product and she gets unbelievable amount of unboxings so um yeah if you aren't on her channel you should really pop on over because she's a regular unboxer and has so many more boxes than me so yeah pop on over to her channel and subscribe because she's awesome and she's almost at 2k so we'll have to hashtag it get Lady Mawa to 2k right so this product I do like it it's a great product but it's not full size like they said naughty birch box but um, yeah, I do like it. I haven't opened this one or used it. It hasn't got a seal on it anyway, but I've got one on my bath waiting for me to use already. And then we had this little thing, which I kind of poo-pooed in the video, kind of slagged it off, but actually fantastic. And I use it every single day and we've had really good weather. Um, I think I just jinxed myself, but we had amazing weather. I've been using it every day and I'm feeling so much more better that I've got 50 SPF on my skin and looking after my face because I do have a lot of freckles so you have to look after your skin don't you so um, yeah I love it it's really full and um, a little goes a long way I mean I thought gosh it's a tiny pot but that will last me months for sure it will last me months so yeah that was that one then we had the eye pencil which I am wearing just now <laughs> excuse the clown look I thought I'd go for bright colours colours to brighten myself up but I ended up looking like Finding Nemo so yeah but I'm going with it so this one is a Lord and Berry pencil and it was a tiny baby thing but my goodness I love it it's really good it goes on really smooth glides on lush and I love it I put it under my under eyes there you can see how strong it is and um, the other the line thing is by I think we got it sent in the post by Pink Parcel anybody get it you had to fill in um um, some kind of questionnaire online and if you got it you got a uh, eye pencil through the post don't know if anybody else got it I got it oh my gosh it's terrible it's like dry as a bone so I got that little wing but that was it so yeah not so great but anyway that's back to Birchbox love this eye pencil it's a bit on the small side but they didn't promise a full size and I like it and I needed an eye pencil so yeah and then the mascara which we got which was the last one this is a nourishing mascara by beautyniquebeauty.com I don't know who these are but um, yeah I am wearing that mascara just now you can't see I have non-existent eyelashes but I think it brightened up my eyes well made them look longer and bigger and made my eyes look better so yeah I do like this mascara it's quite nice it's a baby one so it won't last for too long but I do like it and I have been using it regularly so that is the end of my birch box. I really like my birch box this month um, after using it. And this is the thing, if you're watching this, when I unbox, you're like, mm, it's a bit rubbish, this box. But then once you use the products, you discover, oh, actually, I really like that product. Or, yeah, I'm so glad I tried that because I'd love to buy that full size. So your opinions can change. So when you watch an unboxing video or you unbox yourself, give it time. Because maybe in a couple of weeks after you use the products, you might discover that you actually like it. Um, and that's how I go with my boxes. So that's how I try to be anyway. Right, then we're on to Glossy Box, which is the last one. Glossy Box is a mixture of prices. If you want to go um, 12 months, but you can't cancel, it's 11 75 If you want to go a cancel anytime kind of thing, then it is £13.25. And then there's other payment schedules in there you can get. So pop on over to Birchbox glossy box and you'll find their payment stuff you can also earn glossy credit so if you use my code in my glossy box video which um two people used my code last month so thanks very much these are absolute stars um you get your box cheaper and i get glossy credit so i got a fiver in my in my glossy credit at the moment which i can then spend on look fantastic and get something for a fiver which is pretty awesome and then if you get the box you can then share it with your friends and family get a code get some glossy credit they get money off their box so it just keeps like a cycle but every single youtuber on youtube who unglosses glossy box birch box pink parcel will have for fermi codes in the description bar so follow your favorite youtuber and get some money off your box and then they get some glossy credit or 
little freebies in their boxes, which is nice. Right, okay, so glossy box, we got nail varnish. I'm wearing it. This is it, it's the Love Me Tender nail varnish. Where is it? Here it is. And I had some gorgeous emails and messages from people saying they thought of me because it's Love Me Tender and it's Elvis. So I was just loving that, that people were thinking of me and thinking putting Elvis together with me, which I absolutely love because I'm a massive Elvis fan and he's a massive part of my life. So this is a Love Me Tender nail varnish and I loved it. It's great on the nails. I love the colour. Fantastic. But can you see from my face there, it doesn't last. It chips really, really fast. But I'm used to gel nails now, which I haven't done in a while, but they last for ages. Nail varnish just doesn't last for me, unfortunately. But I do like it. Then we had a contour thing from W... No, it wasn't. Who was it? Um, I can't remember the name offhand. Barry M. I didn't use it and I gave it to my friend and she liked it. And then we got a mud mask, which I haven't used again. This was interesting though, because it was a vitamin serum that you use after you've put on your mask, was it? Yeah, use after a face mask. So it was really interesting, this product, but I haven't used the face mask to try this. Maybe I should try it after my pink parcel scrubber. I think that might be quite a good thing to do. Yeah, I might do that today in the bath. Um, and then we had a blush. I'm wearing the blush just now, although I look as pale as a ghost, but this is because of my lighting. My ring light is just don't know what's happened to it. It's kind of like collapsing in front of my eyes. But we got this and it was Annabelle Minerals. I'm wearing it just now, you can't really see it. It's annoying because it, you have to get your brush in there and it makes an awful mess. And then it doesn't go on even when you put it on. So yeah, I'm not too keen on it to be honest with you. But I have persevered and used it trying to see if it's going to be any nicer. Yeah, maybe it's just better without a brush, just putting it on like that. So yeah, I do like it. Adds to the clown effect today. Um, so yeah, it's not the best, but it's not the worst. And then we had, and I do apologise in my last video, I did not read it properly, which uh, if you're new here, the regular people who are always on my channel will tell you that that's what I do. I don't read the cards properly, or I don't take in the information properly, or I'm just a bit thick really. So, <laughs> terrible. And this is, I thought, Vaseline. 100% natural. Um, or 100% petroleum. It's not. It's 0% petroleum and it's 100% natural. And it's called Naturaline. And it's by Beauty Kitchen and it's a completely natural lip product. So, this is it. My husband's had it for a bit, but then I stole it back. And I've been using it in the morning. Oh, it's my husband's phone. I've been using it in the morning when I get up just to give my lips a little freshen. So yeah, that's been it. Okay, so that is the end of Glossy Box for this month as well, for the month of May. My winner is simply Birch Box. It's gotta be. And I never thought that when I unboxed it, but that happens to me a lot with Birch Box and why I stick around with Birch Box, because I find the products, I actually really like them. And once I've used them, and they are on the smaller side, but I do find I like them. Whatever your favourite box this month was, pop it down in the comments below. And um, yeah, that's it. All right, so take care of yourself. Have a fantastic day and I will see you again this week. I'm getting my tattoo on Wednesday. So I will pop up a video maybe on Thursday after I've edited it and stuff. So yeah, that'll be good. And then I'll be back with my boxes again. All right, take care. Bye.